Hello everyone, it's me is Amari welcoming you to my new tutorial which is for the designing and I made it with the illustrator. So this type of creative post I'll show you how to make this one easily. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. At first going to the file and taking new options 12,000 and 12,000 pixel actually 1200 and 1200 pixel and giving the name hex because of hexagon i just made over there taking rgb color mode for the web purpose cmyk for the like print purpose and hit the create button and after that going to the shape tool going to the polygon i'll make some polygons over here six for the hexagon and hit ok and after that here is i'll make the 90 degree angle turning off the stroke making something big press shift and hold it making this one bigger and then alter option button for the copy and copy like that control command d for the repetition and then controller alter alter for the copy and just make this one so press the arrow key to match with this actually this one is good okay that's good and again you can copy this one and you can make the shape like this so that's good we got this one and now going to the object and compound path and make this one because of you want to make it mask you can change the color i'll change this one black making this one bigger and just placing over there okay if we take this one for our like preferences it will help us out what we are making over there okay that's good going to the file and going to the place options from here i got some images from unsplash.com and making this one just import and i'll make this one into the downside okay and making this one into clipping mask that's good actually that's good so before that i can make this one copy okay selecting all the stops making this one clipping mask and then again going to the rectangle tool making rectangle like this 1200 pixel and 1200 pixel actually we should make this one 1200 and here as well okay placing into the middle of the artboard and then selecting all the stuffs making it clipping mask or we can make this one like that and the photo should be over there or a little bit of this yeah that's fine and then we'll take another you know, like uh, square shape 1200 pixel and 1200 pixel and hit ok and making this one into the downside of the layer okay that's good and then going to the file and place options the image this one will embed over there into the downside making this one into the layer all the layer into the downside okay making into the middle that's good and we'll down the opacity like 95 uh, percent or 90 percent is good that's good and control scene control f making this one into clipping mask and sending into the back side of the layer that's good and this type of shape will take actually I, we took this one and making like this into the stroke mode and then object and expand the appearances from here the gradient will take the gradient into like orange gradient and the black opacity will make it zero so we are getting like that and now the main condition here uh, will take the shape actually this one is our shape so all the shape will take ctrl c and ctrl f and 
we will fill it up with the orange color and making the blending mode into the multiply control command f for the forward paste so deleting this only okay that's good and then the logo you can make this logo easily by using the hexagon making this one 90 degree and okay making this one a little bit of bigger so p from the keyboard and this one the middle okay another portion so p from the keyboard again and this one that's good and now we'll divide this one from the pathfinder tool here is pathfinder and cutting off all the stuffs okay you can make the shape builders tool by using that these these and this so we'll make the change in this portion and the downside we'll make this and we'll make this one okay our logo like this making this one a little bit smaller placing over there writing something the text that is the making this one into the white and making this one bigger and placing over there and making the font which is the roboto like this and this okay our logo we placing it out so our icon and other stuffs will take these this and this control command c control command f for the forward press and placing over there properly and this item should be aligned with this actually we should make this one into the group and this placement should be like this okay that's good and making group yeah that's good and this one should align with this okay this one actually this particle should be over there into this portion and here should be uh, like a hexagon so making another hexagon and rotating this one into 90 degree and picking color by pressing i b from the keyboard and placing over there actually we should place this that's the another particle and this one is our gradient options g from the keyboard and making the gradient like this and all the stops will take another rectangle which is 1200 pixel 200 pixel and making into the upper side all upper side and selecting all the stops right press and make clipping mask so our design is ready so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video is i'm signing out today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers bye bye